6-0 FC. Who saw that coming? Because I definitely did not. Yes, it's Tranmere Rovers. Yes, they are terrible in comparison to the teams that we should be trying to beat in the Premier League. But United professionally and very well, we put Tranmere away. And I swear to God, the start of that game was like a, a long list of things that you don't expect to happen to Manchester United happened. Harry Maguire banging one in from an outside the box. Diogo Dalot doing a little Ronaldo chop, banging it in the corner. Jesse Lingard scoring. Phil Jones scoring from a corner. Martial gets one. Greenwood professionally puts his penalty away. United 6-0. You've got to be positive about that. Yeah, it's a terrible team, but United have played Rochdale this season. we played Colchester this season. We have struggled against lower league opposition. The only thing I'm coming away from that game is a little bit of a tinge of disappointment that we didn't chase that 8-0 record that we've got in the FA Cup and go for broke. I think United might have maybe taken the foot off the gas when he got to about 6-0, but fair enough. Look, today was... I suppose a lose-lose situation for United. Beat Tranmere, it's Tranmere. You should be beating them. Struggle against Tranmere, and that's when the pressure could have been cranked up even more. So that 6-0 will help the confidence of the team. I'm not sure how much of a long-term impact it's going to have. But happy days. Maybe that goal will make a difference to Maguire. Maybe that goal will make a difference to Lingard. And good God, does he need a bit of a difference fired up his ass? But... Given what United is at the moment, given the context around the club, which is, I wouldn't say it's toxic. I would say the feeling among fans is the fact that we are finally putting pressure on Woodward and the Glazers and vocalising it. And people are taking notice. It's not just a couple of fans angrily shouting at the game or on Twitter or anywhere you're going to argue about it it seems to be making a difference at the moment. And I urge all United fans to keep that up. But today against Tranmere, as I said, it was a potential banana skin and we didn't slip. 3-0 up within 16 minutes in absolute cruise control on an absolute abomination of a football pitch. Happy days. No one's gonna take any huge overall messages from that game because beating Tranmere is something that United should be doing with their eyes closed. And today we, we did that. We did it with our eyes closed, but as I said, against the likes of Rochdale and against the likes of Colchester, United have struggled against lower league opposition this season. But today we professionally put them away, which is exactly what we should be doing. Seeing Mason Greenwood step up for the penalty, that was lovely. To Heath Chong nearly got on the score sheet as well towards the end. Could have been seven. It's a shame it wasn't more than six. I wanted United to keep going and keep going. But I suppose the fact that it got to six is a good thing. United did keep going. We didn't get to 1-2-0 against Tramir and take our foot off the gas. But no, but nobody's going to come out of that full of beans, full of massive confidence because we've beaten Tramir. All of a sudden, we're definitely going to put City away for the second leg of the League Cup semi-final. That's not the case. But today, had we struggled, had it been one of those like laborious games where United really struggled to make any sort of opportunities, then there could have been, and there would have been, a negative fallout. But instead, we're coming away from that Tranmere game, 6-0 FC. A little bit of confidence put back into a team which is devoid of any sort of confidence. We saw that in the last game against Burnley. It's not a massive statement from United, but it's a statement nonetheless. 6-0, done. Next round of the FA Cup. Let's see if we can somehow mash this season together and put a Bruno Fernandes on top of it. Maybe even a central midfielder, if we're being fantastical about it. But United need signings in that team to make the rest of this season salvageable. Because if we don't, we're gonna be chasing the top four and probably won't ever get in it. Get new signings, and maybe we can turn the second half of this season around. But I'm happy Maguire's got off with his first goal. Lingard scoring, Phil Jones scoring from a damn corner. I don't really know what was going on in that first half. But United 6-0. Let me know who your man of the match is. I think the strange thing is from that game, nobody really played that well, but nobody really had to. It was Tranmere. But we've beaten them. Let's see what happens next. And as I said, let me know in the comments who your man of the match was.